Serbsky Sinovi, Danny and uh, Mark were here for uh, Slava, for my Saint's Day, St. Saint George. And uh, we started singing spontaneously at the table in three-part harmony. And it occurred to me that these were three voices that could sing in harmony in three different ranges. And I thought that would be nice for an orchestra. And about a year and a half, maybe two years later, I mentioned it to Mark and asked him if he was interested, and he said he was. And we asked Danny, and he said he was. And then we had the good fortune to, uh, to get one of the best accordionist Sasha Slavkovich and uh, Brock Belich to bring some youth and some really fantastic bass playing skill into the orchestra. So that's how it came into existence. <laughs> Serbian music in Pittsburgh is pretty great. Um, a lot of emigres here uh, from the early days and also uh, since the Civil War in Yugoslavia, the former Yugoslavia. And because Duquesne University is here and a lot of people get the opportunity to practice and perfect their music. Seventy-seven. There was a movie, as you know, that was shot. Have you seen it recently? And what do you think when you look at that? Well, in some ways, for me, it's a very joyous experience, and it's a very melancholy experience, melancholy experience because that's my family, and they're gone. Those are my uncles, my mother's brothers. Um, I think uh, I think about a different time. I think of the kind of golden youth I had, 
living in a family where music was always present at family gatherings. We would eat, they would, the adults would drink, the kids would play, and at some point my uncles would pull out their instruments. So music was really an intimate part of our lives, and my uncle Adam, who was in the orchestra, also directed a large choir. Mark directs a choir, a male choir that Danny and I sing in. So some of these traditions have been preserved and perpetuated, and that's really why we play. We play, I think, because we love the music, and it's great music, uh, and it gives us joy to play it. But we also have kids and we want to preserve and perpetuate this culture because music really enriches our cultural lives and our community life a great deal. <laughs> events do you play at? Or how often do you play? How often do you get together? How it's often it's you intermittent. We played at the, the, the Insurance Federation for the Serbian people, had a uh, bowling tournament recently in Aliquippa. We played there. We played in Maryville, Indiana for the, dio the uh, diocese, had a, had a golf tournament, sponsored a golf tournament. We played those kind of events. We played a wedding. We don't play many weddings, but uh, we play those kind of events. And we play, I would say, rather infrequently, really. Uh, there aren't as many opportunities. When I was a kid growing up, there was a dance that the Popovich brothers played at in South Chicago almost every Saturday night, most of the year. So that's changed a lot since they were around. A little more something on bass. One this was like <laughs> <laughs> the worst time ever done. <laughs> yeah. It's okay. Oh, yeah. you guys. <laughs> are, are they fun guys? Of course. I, I the most the people. most fun. I look at you, everybody else is working hard and you just smirk when you come right? <laughs> <laughs> Oh I'm just enjoying the moment. <laughs> Tell it's us what uh, you do for your day job and then go around. Um, I'm, I'm a computer scientist. I work for a company in Bridgeville, PA. Um, we do advanced analytics. Um, four kids playing accordion and uh, enjoying myself at least half of the time. So, How, how old were you when you learned the accordion? Oh, I started when I was about six. Um, kind of have played all the way through, maybe had about five, six years break due to some sports injuries, sports accordion sports injuries. <laughs> and uh, But now it's like, now it's more recreational, so it's, uh, it's definitely fun. Would you uh, give me your name and spell it, please? Uh, my name is Alexander Slavkovic. Um, they usually uh, uh, call me Sasha. It's my nickname. Uh, my, the spelling of my name is A-L-E-K-S-A-N-D-A-R, and the last name is S-L-A-V-K-O-V-I-C, and I dropped the H when I came off the boat, so. <laughs> okay, we're going with a civil engineer. My name is Dan Yovanovich. I'm a civil engineer. I work in a field of municipal engineering. I've been playing this music mm, since 1969, so it's about 41 years now. Basically never quit. I don't golf, I don't bowl, I don't hunt, I don't fish. <laughs> My hobby is Serbian music, I, either playing in a band or singing in Serbian choirs. It's about the only hobbies I have. I, I'm kinda, it kind of consumes my life, but uh, I love it. I love it, uh, I love it with all my heart. Spell your last name. Uh, my last name is Jovanovic, J-O-V-A-N-O, -O, V as in Victor, I-C-H. That's exactly what I was thinking. Do <laughs> <laughs> you teach here? I teach music, yes. Yeah. West Jefferson Hill School District. It's actually right out there, <laughs> right outside Marco's house. I've um, been teaching for nine years. I've been playing this music since I was eight years old. Um, 
I just always have. I have really known no other really kind of music until later in life, of course, but this is what I grew up with. I went to music school at Duquesne University, and then when I got out of the Tambritsons there, I started playing in bands. Great. Give us your name and spell it. Oh, Brock Belich, B-R-O-C-K-B-E-L-I-C-H. Great. He would be too modest to say this at his young age, but he's, Brock is in the Tamaritsa Hall of Fame at a disgracefully young age. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us if you've been well, there is a, there's an organization that sponsors uh, annual Tamaritsa events around the country, that, in different places around the country, and they have a Hall of Fame so that, uh, so that great players are memorialized. And uh, really, I, I don't know of anybody in it who's younger than Brock, uh, but it's, it's well deserved. He's a great player. Okay. Yeah, I'll come okay. yes. that. Okay. <laughs> what are you in? I am. Uh, I work for an IT uh, in, in, uh, information technology services company. I'm in their business development and, and sales uh, department. Okay. And your name and spell it. Mark M A R K, and last name Doncic D O N C I C. I'm a I'm vice president of a communications consulting firm based in Washington D.C. Although I work out of Pittsburgh, and that. Uh, that's after a number of years uh, working on the international staff of the United Steelworkers Union. So I do a lot of work with the nonprofits, with unions, and uh, other nonprofit organizations. That's my job. <laughs> Dobro jutro, moj bekrio, aż de si mi poranio, aż de si mi poranio, o 